Hi, Mr. Lewis here. Uh, we had a little discussion in class the other day about how to strengthen the wrists, and we were talking about different, uh, you know, wrist uh, strengthening devices. And and, uh, and someone in the class, uh, students mentioned that uh, the rope on the stick on the string. And that was a great idea. Some of the people weren't really sure what we were talking about, so I just want to demonstrate uh, how how effective uh, this is. So, uh, just about a five pound weight. You can put any kind of weight on you want with a rope. If you want to hold your arms out nice and straight. And I like having a long staff because I like putting wide grip, uh, middle, and, and then uh, closer and closer and closer every time I go. So you want to bring the rope up all the way to the top. And then you don't want to let it slide to the down. You want to bring it down all the way down to the bottom. This is very hard to do. It's very heavy as I keep my arms straight, my shoulders straight. I bring it up. Try to do as minimum turning the staff as uh, thick as possible. All I do is just kind of check how I keep the rope in the middle. Just go all the way up again. And then all the way down. And again, remain tense. I'm going through and all the way down. Now, this is a great uh, exercise and it works really well. My arms are uh, very tired. Uh, I like to add on to this too. All I do is I just cut two foam uh, pieces and you can use poo noodles as well. I got poo noodles as well. Um, but they're just a uh, copper tubing insulator and you put them on so that it moves through. So now you have to squeeze uh, the staff to be able to lift it up. If you just turn it, would, the weight would lower down. So it just adds an extra uh, grip to your uh, hand, uh, a little bit of your finger exercise as well. Now, I always want to develop a the same tool that I use is just use a 10 pound weight and I place uh, this, this staff in the, the weight and I use uh, the screwing motion. So when we pull into chamber, we have this twisting motion where uh, going up and down uh, works a type of muscle, but when you want that twisting, that twisting motion, you really gotta use the rope on the weight, the weight. And now you use the other hand just to hold it so the weight doesn't go away. You wanna twist, and you're just gonna twist the weight into until uh, you get to the 10 pound area. You unwind, you twist it the other way, unwind, uh, twist it the other arm, uh, both ways. And you get a really full arm workout by bringing it up and down, twist it side to side. And you can always add on for difficulty on your foam. Also bringing, using both your hands. And again, the weight can change. You can make it very versatile. Uh, with the weight making it heavier and less heavy.